what's going on guys welcome back to the channel today we're going over five tips for your first made to measure suit coming up so tip number one on the list is probably the most important one is know what you want a lot of guys that come into the store and when i say store i actually uh, mean indochino i work for indochino this is not sponsored by them by the way this is just kind of my experience so i want to go ahead and teach you guys about it just kind of an fyi so when you come in you basically want to know exactly what kind of style what kind of fit and kind of just an overall kind of essence of what you want the suit to look like because it's hard for me to try to digest what you want if you don't even know what you want so then i'm trying to pick apart pieces of exactly what you need what you want so it's easier and it's a little bit faster of a process if you go in there knowing exactly what you want and what you need uh, this comes down to also the fit of the suit because if you don't know how you want your suit to fit i'm not going to know how the suit's supposed to fit either so always kind of like the essence is like have or how's it go have me help you or let me help you or help me help you there you go so make sure you guys do your research right uh make sure that you guys know the store that you guys are going into whether it be indochino uh suit supply uh articles of style these different places that you can go ahead and get something custom or made to measure uh, you can always go ahead and do some research online take a look at the stuff take a look at customizations know exactly what you want to have know what kind of style you need as well you don't want to go in uh, expecting to get a suit that's going to work for the office if you're going to get a fabric that's completely different that's just for like fall and winter so again just knowing these little tidbit things will definitely assist you and assist the person that's helping you out kind of figure out exactly what you want number two on the list is to go to the shop go to the place that you actually are looking to get the suit from and try to go into the store to get measured uh, it's really hard for you to measure yourself if you've never measured yourself before uh, online videos are very informative and it's really nice to look at and they are very in-depth however you can never kind of get the final result the way that you want it just based off of your own measurements you'll probably need alterations and maybe even sometimes i've seen it uh people would just have their measurements done entirely wrong and it's just not it, there's nothing that we can do about it the suit just looks very ill-fitted just because people could believe that they actually can do their measurements i'm not saying that you yourself probably can't do it i'm sure that there are people out there that can go ahead and measure themselves pretty good and then they'll have a great fitting suit they only need a few minor tweaks as far as alterations but my biggest suggestion is to actually go into a showroom get yourself done right and then that way you reduce the amount of alterations that you'll need and then you'll have a better fitting suit tip number three is to have an open mind have an open mind to people's suggestions especially the person that's helping you out um, we always are trying to analyze exactly all the needs that you need uh, for this suit so it's always a good idea to go ahead and just take a little bit of our advice you don't have to take all of it it's definitely just your suit you're going to be the one wearing it but just be open to those kind of suggestions such as kind of button styles lapel style stuff like that because at the end of the day if you don't know these styles specifically you might be doing an error for yourself in the long run if you just take that advice you'll look crisp and clean before I go into tip number four, just wanted to go ahead and remind you guys to go ahead and follow me on Instagram. If you haven't done so, my stuff will be right here. And I post daily content on there for men's style and men's lifestyle. Stuff such as like my outfit of the day. Also, my stories are a little bit funny. So go ahead and check those out. Number four on the list is going to be to not bring your significant other with you to the showroom. And I know a lot of you guys are going to hate me for this and ladies are going to hate me for this as well. But I've been running into this issue a lot and it makes me just cringe. It makes me cringe every time a guy <laughs> asks their lady, you're like laughing in the back. It's so true though. <laughs> Tip number four is to not bring your significant other with you uh, when you're actually going through this experience if you don't have to. So if the person's with you and they want to help out with the process all that cool uh but sometimes 
I have seen a lot of guys get into the point of like they don't even know what they want and then they're asking their girl for everything everything on the suit so for example a guy will walk in and then I'll ask them like what kind of lapel style do you like and they'll go ahead and turn around what well, what do you like babe it's like no 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 the girl it, she's not gonna be wearing it you're gonna be wearing it you have to know exactly what you want that goes back to like their tip the first one that kind of went over that so make sure that you know exactly what you want that way you don't need to be asking your lady that's not going to be wearing the suit because you're not telling your lady what kind of dress that she needs to put on what color what size all that other good stuff she kind of has her own style and everything else she's just going to look good for you and she knows exactly what looks good on her so just like that the suit needs to be for you you could bring the lady just as i mentioned before there's nothing wrong with that but just make sure that you know exactly what you want and you know kind of like all the little customizations you can kind of have a little bit of suggestions from her as well and it just makes the process a little bit easier especially when you're not asking somebody else right next to you all the questions that i've just asked you is just going to make the process even longer and it also feels like it's just going to be a suit for them it's not going to be for you tip number five and i think it's the most important is to understand that this is a process so don't get frustrated uh, make sure that you uh, go in again with an open mind and the understanding that it is going to take a little bit of time for you and for us to get your fit down because everybody comes in with a completely different body type not everybody is the same so we have to do tweaks in order to actually get your suit the way that you want it whether you want something hemmed you want something a little bit more tapered that's definitely up to personal preference and we're not going to know that right off the bat we'll try to incorporate that into the first fitting but if you need to have any kind of alterations thereafter we're still trying to help you out i know people that come back for like maybe three different alterations because they want things done differently and that's perfectly okay as long as they continue to try to get that perfect fit for you in the long run that first suit sets everything up for all the next ones that you get thereafter so make sure that you take your time don't get frustrated don't get frustrated with anybody that's helping you out just because we're trying to make the process easier for you. Don't expect something to come right out the box and to fit you just right. You will need some alterations, so just make sure that you understand that. Again, if it was your first time here, definitely go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Make sure you join the family. Also, go ahead and hit that bell button to get notifications every time I post a new video. I thank you again for your time, and as always, style up.